to oppose the amendment. The gentleman is recognized for five minutes. Mr. Speaker, I strongly oppose this amendment. I'm deeply surprised the gentleman from Michigan would, uh, in fact, propose the amendment. He has one of these bears from his state, and a lot of hunters are not wealthy. This is a legal activity in Canada. They hunted these bears prior to 2008 and even prior to 2007. These are dead bears, and they're sitting in Canada. When the hunters hunted legally, the Canadian government gave them the proper authority to do so, and it helped the native villages. Right now, there's more bears in Canada than there ever has been in the longest they know in history. Hunting is a vital process of management of game. And these people included two wounded veterans. They're in Iraq in that heated area. The one dream they had when they got back was able to go and hunt a polar bear. And I can understand that. They shot their trophies legally with the blessing of the Canadian government and the local province. And then they expected to be able to return those bears, those hides, and yes, even sometimes the body back home for proper display of their hunt. And now to say you can't import something when a bear was declared threatened by, yes, the Bush administration, and wrongfully so. The bears are not threatened. There are more bears now than there was in 1964. I'm probably the only individual ever shot a polar bear in 64 on this floor, and I'm certainly not rich. I'm suggesting respectfully this amendment is ill-placed, poorly thought out, and improper. I want those people that did th legally by a nation of our neighbors, blessed by the province, to be able to bring those trophies back home as they have the right to do. And yet the act of a Secretary of Interior took it away from them arbitrarily. And I reserve the balance of my time.